Hi, I'm Dr. Noelle Bissell, Director of the New River Health District. As we continue to respond to the COVID-19 public health emergency, I wanted to take a moment to remind you of some critically important things to help protect yourself and those around you. First and foremost, please understand that while COVID-19 testing does help us understand the prevalence of disease in the community, it is not a panacea. It's not a silver bullet or a substitute for personal protection. The outcome of the test likely will not change the medical advice for your treatment, your recovery, and your outcome. What is vastly more important than the results of tests or the number and location of confirmed tests is the urgent need for people to practice good personal hygiene. Wash your hands frequently and thoroughly. Clean and disinfect surfaces often. Practice social distancing by keeping six feet between you and others. Stay home if you're sick. Avoid others who are sick and try not to touch your face. These are the things that keep you safe, that keep those around you safe, and provide the most effective personal protection for you and those that you love. While we know people are interested in testing, it's important to note that not everyone should or needs to be tested. Testing resources are in demand, and the supply, while increasing every day, has not matched that demand. At this time, we screen everyone, and we test those at highest risk. Everyone who has a medical need for COVID-19 testing will be referred and is getting tested. Though we have rising numbers and of confirmed cases in Virginia, that's to be expected with increasing testing. We know that the vast majority of COVID-19 tests are negative, meaning that these patients do not have COVID-19. Their symptoms are caused by the flu or another virus. Similarly, the vast majority of people who test positive for COVID-19 can stay home and recover uneventfully, not requiring medical intervention. That is the best way to protect themselves and those they love. As we face this global public health emergency, we need to protect our critical health infrastructure. We must not unnecessarily burden our emergency departments or our first responders. If you are experiencing a true health emergency, a heart attack, a stroke, or respiratory distress, please call 911 but please do not go to the emergency room or your local health department to request a COVID-19 test. Do not call 911 if you have a fever, a cough, or cold or flu symptoms. When you do that, you make those resources unavailable to the people who truly need them. Anyone with questions or concerns about COVID-19 should call the New River Health District Public Health Call Center at 540-267-8240 between 8 a.m. and 8 p.m. Monday to Friday, 8 a.m. and noon on Saturday, and noon to 4 p.m. on Sunday. Finally, local government agencies, hospitals and healthcare providers, public safety, educational institutions and community services agencies have convened the Montgomery County Public Health Task Force to provide unified management and messaging to area residents as we navigate this crisis. It will not be over quickly but I'm confident that we will respond effectively and support each other with compassion and consideration. If you want to help, consider volunteering for the Medical Reserve Corps, a network of medical and non-medical volunteers that are organized regionally across the state to improve the health and safety of our communities by providing services and support during emergencies like this. Please visit the website on your screen, www.vdh.virginia.gov slash SWVAMRC. For the most accurate and up-to-date information, please continue to monitor websites such as the Montgomery County Public Health Task Force, the Virginia Department of Health, the Center for Disease Control and Prevention, and the New River Health District specific website that is on your screen, nrvroadtowellness.com. Thank you. Please protect yourself and those around you. We will see this through. We're all in this together. It's what Virginians do.